Overvoltage protection circuits are built into some power supplies to prevent a shorted regulator from damaging the computer. In this power supply, a 5 volt output is being sent to the computer. But suppose the regulator transistor shorts out. Well, this will cause 12 volts to be applied to the computer. And it won't take very long before the entire computer board is destroyed by the excess voltage. To prevent a shorted regulator from damaging the computer, some game manufacturers have included a circuit called a crowbar. The crowbar circuit is made of the Zener diode and the SCR with a small handful of other components. Under normal circumstances, the Zener diode will not be conducting. It's a 5.6 volt Zener, and a normally working power supply like this will have an output of just 5 volts. But if the regulator were to short circuit, causing excessive output voltage, the Zener diode will start to conduct and gate the SCR. When the SCR is gated or turned on, it conducts directly from the output of the supply down to ground and shorts the power supply output immediately to ground, which of course is zero volts. This protects the computer from any excessive voltage. Boy, it's a good thing that games are easier to repair than they are to play. You can see that the regulated supplies that we use in video games and pinball machines aren't particularly difficult to understand. And once you understand how they work and with those all-important meter tests that we looked at earlier, there's no reason that you can't repair any regulated power supply in any electronic game. Well, that's all the time we have for now. I'll see you next time at the Arcade School. Bye-bye.